So um, I spoke with one of our staff people um, about an interaction he had with a relative over the holiday. What happened was his relative expressed to him some really negative uh, thoughts and perceptions of immigrants. And our staff person at that moment could have chosen lots of different kinds of responses, gotten really defensive, gotten angry about um, some of the attitudes that this relative was expressing. But instead, he, he listened really carefully to try to understand where his relative was coming from. And then he shared with him um, his own experiences working with immigrants on a day-to-day -day basis here at JFCS. And um, he talked about the attitudes that the immigrants he works with have expressed, the gratitude that they feel for being in this country, the challenges that they've experienced, and basically kind of was able to talk through some of the negative stereotypes that his relative had expressed without being attacking or disrespectful. And by the end of the conversation, the relative was really appreciative that, um, that our staff person had been so open and understanding. And when I heard that story, I was just so inspired by um, the respectful, tolerant, and openness that our staff person had about something that I know he's really passionate about. If we encounter someone who thinks differently than us and we have an interaction that's aggressive in which both of us are kind of digging our heels in and uh, aren't really open to hearing the other person, then I think it can be a really uncomfortable interaction. But if we're able to find a way to do that from a place of respect, from a place of understanding and patience, and a willingness to, to be open to hearing the other person, then I think those kinds of conversations can actually be really powerful. And it's hard to do that, especially regarding things that we feel passionate about. Um, but uh, I, I think it's something that each of us, myself included, can work on and can improve in and, uh, in helping us to become a more tolerant, more accepting community.